What up, fam? So I hope life is going back to normal wherever you are in the world. LA is finally opening up, and I think I might go watch a movie with the wife because it's been like a while. So I have two of these Lego 3-in-1 set number 31109 pirate ships because I want to double them up. So I've been following this dude, Mock Your Bricks, both on Instagram and on YouTube, or how my son says it, TubeTube. So he was able to put out kind of building instructions, kind of. It's more like a video instructions for this set right here, Lady Cutlass. He has two versions of these that you kind of look at if you really want to do it. All you really need are two of these 3-in-1s, some string, and some sails from OK Brickworks. Now this dude introduced me to OK Brickworks and, well, if you need replacement placement sales, stickers, or anything kind of mock e for fabric, I definitely recommend this. I'm actually gonna open this right now, right here. And here are the sales. They are a little pricey, but they are laser cut. And this is actually pretty cool. It's gonna look really dope. This is gonna take me some time to do because well, I'm not following instruction instructions. I'm looking at a YouTube video. So wish me luck. All right, ready, set, go. And I'm finished. So here is what two of these three-in-ones make if you were to combine them together to make a little bit more epic ship. It's really not that much bigger than I was expecting. I should have built the first one before I built this one so I, I can at least tell the scale between what this is and what it was before. But based on the pieces that I have used, it's almost double the size, I guess. I, I mean, I really don't know. Here are all the extra pieces that I have left. Now it's a lot but i did expect not to be able to use a lot of this you can tell as there's been kind of building randomness which is cool because now i have a lot of extra pieces to be able to put in the parts collection like i said i should have built the other one it's a great looking ship for what it is is it worth the price point that it took for me to make this thing remember each set was a hundred dollars plus the sales were around 40 something so like around 250 in comparison to the barracuda that you can currently get at the lego store so here all right uh -oh. so here is the barracuda it is still smaller than the barracuda itself 200 dollars versus 250 it's really up to you to decide which one you think is more worth the other like i said 
Barracuda is still larger in scale, but this one is comparable to what it was before. The one thing that I do like about this is the level of detail of the aft and rear of the ship. This back portion of the ship, all these windows, the detail of this part right here is really attractive. And you could also open up the inside, be able to see the interior. Each hatch right here opens both sides to be able to get the interior of the ship. The ship is also armed with one more cannon than the Barracuda because the Barracuda only has three cannons, I believe. Armament wise, it is a lot more dangerous. So I guess smaller ship, faster and more armed. It's something to be reckoned with, that's for sure. As far as the building is concerned, this was somewhat of a hassle just because I am following a video more so than instructions. There are instructions, I would definitely recommend using that. The build technique is pretty dope. The cloth sails brings the accent to this ship a lot higher and the string which take place of the rope that would be on a ship adds that extra highlight and accent to the ship. The masts are fragile. They're not heavy duty like the Barracuda. You're using Technic stems, so it is a little wobbly. It's not a Lego piece. So the masts are not as stable. And I probably should have tightened the strings more. So I would recommend you guys checking out Mocker Bricks. He does have instructions online that you can make his custom ships from. He does add a PDF to the instructions in case you want to make your own. Or you can go on OK Brickworks to be able to get these sales yourself. As for me personally, I like the ship. It's interesting. It's different. I did not expect it to be what this was. It does have some playability, not much like this anchor here, it does move. And I'm gonna look at his other ships to be able to create one of his mocks because they are beautiful. So definitely check him out. Check out Mock Your Bricks. Check out OK Brickworks. If you made it with me all the way to the end of this video, give me a thumbs up, thumbs down, like, comment, subscribe below. And I'll see you on the next video. Hi guys. Peace. 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 Peace.